everybody, this is Praxis, and I'm back on site after several days of not being here, just because there really is a lot, there wasn't much of anything that I could do. The weather's turned really cold, the ground's all frozen, which means you can't do any uh, digging and moving of dirt around this foundation, we can't stomp the foundation on the inside, any kind of carpentry work is just really uncomfortable, because it's just... It's just really freezing cold, and there's not really any reason to do carpentry on the inside because without windows, the whole inside of the house is really cold. It's just, it's uncomfortable, and there's nothing really critical that I can do. I'm just waiting on the windows at this point. Right now, they're about a month late, um, and that's just the nature of this, this stuff. I, they, they said that it was a two-week lag time between putting in the order and getting it. I left four weeks to put some extra padding on there, but we're coming up on six weeks. Uh, and the windows are not here yet. Uh, we also have a winter storm coming in in the next couple hours. We're supposed to get between a foot and a foot and a half of snow here. Uh, so I just showed up to kind of tidy things up. And I was going to put a tarp over this last section of roof over here. You see the open exposed section of roof. We left that so we'd have access to get the peak pieces on. Uh, I was going to put a tarp up, but all these tarps, they're all covered in chunks of ice and mud and stuff. Uh, you know, frozen mud. Uh, and I think, honestly... I'd be bringing more filth up there by putting one of these really messy tarps with all these ice chunks on it than it would be if I just let the snow fall on it and maybe a bunch of it will blow off anyway. So uh, what I've really been doing is just tidying up the site, uh, getting it clear so we're, get, we're ready for a, a plow to come in uh, because we're going to have to plow because right after the snow is when the windows are scheduled to show up. And I think they'll show up this time because we have an actual schedule. Uh, but... Uh, you know, I'm just getting the area cleared up for that. Once they do show up, we're going to get all the windows on as quickly as we can. And then that will start warming up the inside of the house. And once the inside of the house is warm, we can uh, receive the slab. They can do the slab pour on the inside because you need to have the... Uh, you need to have concrete be at a certain temperature uh, in order for the cure to go uh, properly. You can't have the, the, con the water and the concrete freezing on you while it's trying to cure. So uh, the house has to have that kind of warmth, uh, ability to be warm in order to get the concrete. So uh, waiting to seal it up so we can use concrete and also waiting to seal it up so we can do all the car carpentry work on the inside because it's just, it's just so... You know, it's just really cold. I keep touching my fingers because they're, they're painful after grabbing all this stuff on site and picking it up. So that's it. I'm pretty much done for the day. Now we just let the snow fall and, uh, you know, see what it's like on the other side of that. That's it. Thanks for watching.